Hello, 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 and a very warm welcome to Card for the Day by Healing Hand Services. And my name is Julie Sean. Today is Friday, the 12th of February 2021. Amazing day, numerology wise, with all those twos and all those ones. It's a good day of change and a day of abundance. Um, I am using the cards Keepers of the Light by Carl Gray, and I will just Get the cards together, shuffle. Let's do a quick shuffle mix, really mix it up. Really mix the cards. And then let's see, connecting in with our angels, our archangels, spirits, and guides, gods and goddesses, and the masters and elementals. And just to see, oh, look, there's a card to come up. So we have, oh, Lady Portia, divine order. Do what you feel is right. An important lesson is unfolding. Do what you feel is right. Or the purple vein. She is um, a twin flame, and I can never remember with who, but this is all purple, all to do with the violet flame, transmuting, okay? And it's an important lesson, and it's telling you to do what is what you feel right working from your heart center your true and connecting with your third eye and your spiritual connection what is the right thing for you i know it sounds very selfish but if you don't look after number one who else is if you are in a job you are unhappy about you just feel it so do something about it this is all what it's about and today is all about change are you in a relationship that you aren't happy with change it are you in a situation you're not happy time for change are you like a financial situation you're not like well stop burying your head time to change time for you to learn from the the situation you're in why am i in this situation how did i get here well it's really basically down to you and you're realizing my life is all down to my responsibility for all my actions or all my inactions, for all the things I said, all the things I didn't say, all the things that I didn't listen to, or I wasn't, you know, hearing and taking note, taking responsibility. It is a lesson. I could say often, you know, people go, oh, you know, I'm, I'm in a relationship. Well, did we put a gun to your head to say you have to be in this relationship? Oh, it's difficult for me to move out. Well, that's because you're putting up these barriers. Oh, I'm in a job. I, if I leave it, I won't have a job. Well, start looking for another job. You know, um, I'm in a financial mess. Well, I'm not dealing with it. We'll start dealing with it. Sort it out. Contact the um, financial people who can help you, citizens advice, etc. There's lots of help out there. But instead of burying your head, go Oh my God, look at the mess. Acknowledge it. Acknowledge the situation you're in. I am in here. Acknowledge it is due to your actions or your inactions. And that is the time, you know, it is the lesson. That's the greatest lesson to remember that we are all responsible for our own choices. And if we don't say anything to anyone and don't voice what we feel and what we act, then we've only got ourselves to blame. Or if you are in a controlling situation, maybe it's time for you to learn to find yourself self-confidence to stand up to it. Make plans to move out. It's you who's responsible. Now, the violet flame is a sign of transmuting, transmuting to the good, removing the negative, and changing everything, burning all the negativity away and, cre and, and creating good positive side of things in. Look at all the violet and it's connecting with your spiritual self. What is good for your spirit? What is good? What is the angels and spirits and guides giving you? What message do you need to deal with? Lady Portia, she is a female. She is all <coughs> nurturing, mothering. Are you nurturing yourself? Let us see what Lady Portia <clears throat> is all about excuse me a minute oh that's venus lady portia <clears throat> divine order so let us see it's beautiful color it's really telling you to connect with your spiritual self and your spiritual angels and guides 
The powerful goddess is a figure of justice and peace. She brings order and opportunity to every experience. As a lord of karma, she also regulates the law of cause and effect. She helps us recognize the impact of our judgments, choices and actions of ourselves and the world. She is the twin flame of Saint Germain, so is strongly connected with the violet flame energy. Together, these twin flames can work as overseers of legal situations. Justice is an energy that's about honouring everyone involved rather than punishing bad behaviour. Lady Portia helps us to do what is right morally and spiritually, spiritually for our soul's growth. So it's all purple there, our soul's growth. Right now, a call for justice is being brought into your space. Even if this means you will lose out, there really is no loss in the highest state of truth. Act from the heart. See the other person's point of view and surrender your pride so that you, can, you are coming from a loving space. If you've made choices that weren't for the highest good, admit it. Though this honest, through this honesty, you are releasing any karmic bonds or anchors of fear from your energy. Take the time to learn from this situation. And if you're involved in any legal issues, know that Lady Portia and the Angels of Justice are gathering round to honour everyone involved. So it's basically saying recognise the impact of your judgments. Recognise that you are actually responsible for yourself. For everything that you've created around if you've got nothing around you it's because you keep saying I haven't got anything and I'm not and I don't feel worthy of it and that's what you're creating but take responsibility and once you take responsibility don't beat yourself up because in that past that you didn't realize you were responsible for anything accept it release it but it is a bit about karma justice energy and like they said, you know, it's like you will lose out. Oh, well, I'm in this relationship. If I leave, I've got nowhere else to live. Poor me. I'm losing my home. Actually, you can find a lovely place to live and it will be a home of peace and love. So you're gaining. I know at the moment you think, oh, I'm walking out. Where am I going to go? Contact your friends. See if you can sleep on their, in their spare room, on their couch, if you need to get out of a situation. <clears throat> and then start anew. And then you create a new beautiful home. You're not happy in your job. Well, once upon a time, it was the perfect job, you thought, because you applied for it. You went for the interview. They offered you the job. You chose to take that job. And now it's your chance to go, well, actually, it's not really the job I thought. Talk to the manager. Communication. Communicate with yourself what is doing the best for yourself. But it's all about transmutation, transmuting the negative into a positive. Surrender your pride. It's OK if it didn't work out. Oh, God, I've got to lose face. Hey, you know what? So what? Don't let pride get pride and ego get in the way. No, 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 no because you're just going to make things worse. Just transmute it and go, yeah, I set up a business. It didn't work. Well, maybe well, this wasn't the right time to set up a business. Or maybe you went about it the wrong way. That's fine. Maybe you need help. Ask for help. It's OK to ask for help. But it's time to be honest with yourself. Take responsibility. Connect what is really truthful for yourself and your higher self and connect with your heart center, your soul, your spirit and transmute. Time is now for change, change and taking responsibility. And today's date, the 12th of February, year 21, <clears throat> lots of twos. It's all about change and change now, change for the positivity. And if you add the 12th of February to 2021, add all those numbers together, that all becomes 10, which comes down to one. Unity, starting again, new beginnings, starting afresh. So today is the day to do it. We had, we've got the still effect of the new moon from yesterday, 
the new, mo new moon, it has the effect of the day before, the day of, and the day after. So day, today, it's still got the time to do that changing. And of course, it's the Lunar New Year, the Chinese New Year today, start of a new year, start of new beginnings. I mean, what more of a bigger message do you need from the universe to take responsibility, to stop playing the martyr, take responsibility and go, you know what? I don't like my life. Today is the day to start changing or start taking those steps. I'm in debt. OK, start acknowledging it and doing something about it. I'm not happy about my job. OK, acknowledge it. Do something about it. Talk to your boss. Look for a new job for you. Maybe it's something you want to do completely different. Start looking at it today. You've got the weekend. You're not in the right relationship. You're feeling well. Communicate. Today is the day to start communicating. Don't start thinking or guessing what you want. Start speaking. If you are in a relationship where your life and people around you are in danger, today is the day to reach out for help somehow. My heart goes out to you. Reach out. Today is the day to change. But the thing is, it is a day to change for an abundance. Two is all about abundance, creativity. It's good. OK, you may have to go through a little bit of ugh. But today is all about positive change and everything you change, do today and act today. It is the basis of a year of great abundance. Meditate. Call in Lady Portia. Lady Portia, Lady Portia, Lady Portia. Help me transmute with the violet flame everything and remove from me everything that is of negative and keeping me down in my lower energies. Lady Portia, I ask you to transmute all these negative energies into positive energies and help rise me up, rise me up into a world of positivity and abundance and a pure, true love. Thank you, Lady Portia. Together with you, your violet flame of transmutation and with me, we are amazing. Thank you, Lady Portia. If you've enjoyed this reading, please message me um, and hopefully, I've, and if you'd like your own reading, message me and I'll make a, a, a booking for you. Otherwise, if you've enjoyed the reading, please press the subscribe buttons so you receive daily, weekly and monthly readings. Have an awesome day, a day of taking responsibility, taking charge of your life and change and change for the better. Have an absolutely amazing day. Namaste. Bye. 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 Bye.